is Brent. I'm with Davis Chocolate. I'm a chocolatier and the owner. I'm here to present to you a new remarkable product, which is a remeltable product. The great thing about this is that you don't need to temper it. As you know, it can be challenging and time consuming to be able to remelt a chocolate product. With our product, you actually just have to get a container. We're using a Pyrex measuring glass. You would then take the chocolate and you would break it up. This comes in chips and we have some in bars as well. Uh, for the industrial companies that uh, just want chips, we sell those as well and we can do them different. There's two types, two main types of chocolate we have here. We're also going to do this for 30 seconds. Is we have a liquor so that way you can add your own sweetener to that. Uh, for example, on the make your own bar version, you would melt down for a simple bar, uh, one quarter cup of the liquor, and then you would add in the sweetener of your choice, nuts, inclusions, anything you have for powdered sugar. If you're just using measuring cups and you don't have a scale, you would have the half of a cup of the cocoa, what we're calling hero cocoa, and then you would also add in a quarter cup of the powdered sugar, so half a quarter cup of the liquid here, and then, which is not liquid yet, we're going to do another one. This is 30 seconds. So now we do it in 15 second increments. So one quarter cup, and then a quarter cup of powder because the specific density is a lot uh, lighter, or a eighth of a cup if you're doing just cups, otherwise you could use a scale. And we'll have some recommendations on the recipes that you can do. Now it's getting nice and liquid. Looks like we need a little bit more, so we'll go for another 15 seconds. It's best to get the temperature to 113 degrees Fahrenheit, so you'll need a temperature gauge for that. And then from here, we can then, which we're not using liquor, we're using a semi-sweet, we can pour it right into the mold. But if you're gonna add nuts into the product, this would be the time to take it. As we have, it's all liquid now. So as I said, this is a semi-sweet version. So we can then pour it right into a chocolate mold of your design or you can put it into different types, which is a cup, so that way you can pour milk into it and then eat the cup, like in the movie Willy Wonka. And then we also have a chocolate bomb, which are great and becoming more famous nowadays. You can make your own bomb. Peanut butter cup, molds, anything that you'd like, or you can put it back into chips, spell your name out, do lots of different things. But moving on to the next stage, if we were to do a bar. We would just take this, pour it in there, and you can do it on a scale if you want the exact dimensions. Shake it, and then you would go ahead and put it in the refrigerator for about uh, 10 minutes, but it'll vary based off of the size of your product. So those are the two wonderful products that we have. In doing so, uh, you can make your own bar, or you can buy it in chips, or you can put it into your cookies, and other items that you have, cakes, etc. Thank you very much for the time.